Hey nerds, welcome to Jerry Berry X. Today we're going to react to Season 1, Episode 5 of Lucifer, entitled Sweet Kicks. Sweet Kicks. If you're new here, feel free to subscribe for daily content. If there's a day, there is a reaction. Links will be in the description box down below for the Patreon, the Twitch stream, and everything in between. Jerry is going to do his best work behind the scenes, and we're going to hop into this and uh, continue on our escapade here with, with Lucifer as a, as a detective. Young Lucifer, young Chloe, as she tries to get more information about who he really is, because we tried shooting him to see that he was really the devil, and that shit didn't work. So we're just going to keep the shit moving. I'm going to go ahead and put Jerry to work. We're going to hop into this one pretty quickly. Bing, bam, bop. Even the mistress of excess is impressed. There's a lot of people. Okay, that's why I was waiting. I didn't want to pause on somebody's butt cheeks. There's a lot of people out there that collect shoes. We talked about it in She-Hulk, but I remember when people started first doing this like generic flame drawing thing. And I watched my brother do it when I was a young kid. And I was like, bro, that's the coolest thing I've ever seen. And he was like, it's super easy. Here's how you do it. So then we just started drawing flames. And I thought I was the coolest kid ever for knowing how to draw a fire like that. I still do it from time to time. Like if I'm doodling, if I'm if I'm not paying attention during a meeting, I'm just like, do, 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 flames. Hip, hip. Oh, Benny. Oh, Ooh. Ooh. Don't Benny. tease him with a knife now. He's into that shit. You were shot and you bled. No shop objects until we find out why. Oh, gorgeous. You tell me your most dangerous design. Cheeseburger. Cheeseburger? Really? Oh, the poor... Oh, no. Because, you know, they don't be letting models eat. Nothing. Two gummy bears. Half a teaspoon of rice. And water. That's all they get. It's fucked. She just wants a damn cheese. Who doesn't want a cheeseburger, bro? I'd go for three cheeseburgers right now. He made his moves pretty quick. Like, he got back there and started smooching, like, ASAP. He didn't even question it. You want a cheeseburger? I'll get you as many cheeseburgers as you want. Oh! Pain. Oh, my fuck. Oh, she got shot. Like a bunch. That song lasted forever. But that's our new case. Right here. Somebody got shot at a, at a fucking fashion show. I can think of a few other choice names. I have a complete whack job. Don't worry. This from morning starts completely out of my life. Right. <laughs> right behind you, that is. Oh, he's in there. Look, he's playing with cups. Look at him. Just swooning. Oh, that's me. Hello, Olivia. What else have I seen Olivia in? I can't I can't put a face yet. I'll look it up after the episode if I remember. But like if you guys are working in like this FBI stuff, right? If you're if you're doing this CSI fucking LAPD bullshit, you can just have anybody on the street working with you, because I don't feel like that's the case. Give this man a job or don't, you know? Talk. Someone mm -hmm. with charm, likability. And has real ties to the community. Here it comes. Lucifer Morningstar has volunteered to act as a liaison in the Pella Cortez case. There we go. You're welcome, Decker. Steady on. And he's gone like Batman over again. <laughs> Take your finger off the trigger, bro. Totally get me killed. Probably. Lucy, I'm home. I don't know what voice I want to do for it. I think I'm just kind of cool with that. I don't know if I want to go that. Could you possibly the devil? I am the devil. Historically invincible until now, and that's what makes this case so exciting. Real danger. It's the perfect opportunity to see what other mortal qualities I have. It does make a really good point because he is the devil, 100%. And right when she's on like the precipice, like right when she's about to figure it out, he's like, Hey, ow, you shot me. I'm bleeding. She's like, Oh my God, I actually almost believed this shit. So him becoming more mortal. It does nothing just but progresses the story, which is really, really, really nice. It hold it holds I mean, off on that last this. moment. Exactly. How's that? Bloody hell, that hurt. Dude, it's nice to see. Benny's the name of my bull on World of Warcraft. Pig. For sure. And mm -hmm. his pig. His name is Pig Diddy. This is my assistant Hector. Oh. Hector and coming. Pig Diddy. Ex Marine, bitch. Right. Yes, Benny and I go back to the start of his. That's fine. Who gives a shit? Huh. Mention this at the crime scene because my fans aren't just buying shoes; they're buying Benny Choi, artist, activist, man of the people. 
You know, I wore colors back in the day. Asian boys. I was low level, you know, punk. Got out before the cops even knew my name. Ah, protecting your rep. Wouldn't want to risk that seven-figure endorsement deal, would we? I didn't talk because if a Latin king hears an ex-Asian boy done dry stitch him to the cops, those thugs will retaliate. That's a clash them. right there. I was trying to prevent more death. Well, aren't we the little saint? <laughs> Hello, Mr. Pig. Motherfucker's name is Pig Diddy. Your favors to a former gang felon? Oh, I've been giving favors for thousands of years. Bar and get dangerous with some bottom shelf. Ooh, dangerous with some bottom shelf stuff. That's the cheap. Ooh. Just take a couple shots to the head. No big deal. Mm, I don't. Normally, I feel like early on, this would be a good point to be like, oh, this may be what happened. It could just end up being some basic ass gang shit. Benny could have planned it himself. Hector could have planned this shit himself. Or somebody could have got caught in the crossfire of some gang violence. If it is the gang violence stuff, she says she wants the support of the minorities for her fucking campaign to be chief of police. Then that could all tie together right here. Hmm. I got nothing so far. Take a while. Hey, we already we, we, we already did the credits. We already did the intro stuff. So why the fuck's my subtitles up top? Huh? You said you got an old lady trapped inside your body. Oh, never mind. There's still credits at the bottom. I'll shut up. Surely you've heard the expression. Deal with the devil. Exactly. Come on, give me a break. Well, people come but to yeah. me to ask for favors, and more often than not, I'm happy to oblige. What do you get? Well, sometimes I've something in mind, but usually, like with Benny, it's simply to be repaid at a later date. A devilish IOU, if you will. Who would take a deal like that? That's a dangerous game to fucking play. They all do. Yeah, all of them. Oh, metal bitch. Why is old boy in this? And why does he always play a fucking police officer in, like, everything that he does? Like, that's just his role, is a police officer. They just always have him for something. Change my mind, I'll take a shot. Aha, uh -huh. so you're a snitch, a narc. No wonder nobody likes you. Yeah, you think I was guilty of the crime. Yeah, you know, Damn, he said, said you always snitch oh, ass thanks, mother lover, mother so brother. Yeah, you really yeah, helped. I don't know. I just... Firstly, let me state that I'm in no way standing up for my associate detective Decker, but on behalf of myself and only myself, I think you're a complete sack of ass. Sack of ass. This motherfucker just threw a Will Smith slap style punch. I watched him force push somebody through some glass. Just the other day. And he just threw the wimpiest right punch I've ever seen in my life. He laid Buddy out. It was a fact. It doesn't matter about the form. But holy shit. He called him a sack of ass. That's one of my things. So this motherfucker can come down. Y'all got a little thing going on, bro? Because he, she licked your face one time. And now you're out here this stalking her and her favorite. favorite really? I want to appreciate her saying that favorite at the same time. The next torturing themselves with dreams they know deep down they will never achieve it can be pain reminds me of home. so he can disguise himself in human form and walk amongst people he doesn't always have to fly down and slow down time with his wings he just did that shit for show good to know that's all i had it's a nice ass suit though he got on that bet she would love that ridiculous suit here I thought you were the royal soul. Whatever. I now, I remember when I was in my therapist office, the way that it was set up, like, down in a basement, and, like, you know, it was, like, well-furnished, and there's multiple different offices for different people, different therapy, different other things, whatever. Uh, I would hate to work there, because that shit would be sketchy as hell around nighttime. Okay. We heard the wings. How did you get in here? What the fuck did that just say? There's no way that's what that subtitle said. Hold on. No. One, two. Yeah, we heard your wings. Okay. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to start. Okay, when I first read this, it went by so quickly, I thought it said, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to sterile you. That's a hell of an ability. Don't do that to people. I'm Dr. Kane. Oh, okay. Hi. Well, I'm Linda. Uh, Dr. Martin. Didn't know you could uh, lie as an angel. Good for him. Telling a whole ass fib. That's a sin! You're now a sinner! That's exactly why I'm here. 
Corey is the mother of my child, imbecile. You want to work this case? Take care of her. Sir, yes, sir. Hey, man. You know what? I thought Detective Douche was about to come in here and be a real Johnny McAsshole, but he actually made some pretty that's solid points. He's like, hey, you're, you're, you're stirring the pot. If you're going to be on the case, Chloe's the mother of my kid. Yada, yada. Just take care of her. Boop, boop, boop. I thought he was going to come in and threaten him, honestly. So I, I still feel like he has a little bit of jealousy. Uh, but I thought he was going to come in and say some stupid shit. I'm glad it didn't go that way. Good for him. He earned one point of respect in my book. He just comes off as a tool. Maybe it's his, his natural energy. I don't know. Uh, detective, you seem to have left on the central locking. Act just, like a child, get treated like a child. Just unlock the door from the inside. In it is. It is. It's legal to leave children and dogs locked in a car. So, no one's half the battle. G.I. Joe. How the hell did you get out of the car? Child's play. And good thing I did. There was immediate danger. He was about to leave this woman completely unsatisfied. <laughs> what the? Hey, hey, down. He's your partner? Yeah, don't get me started. Oh, my what we do, and God. Our house? I should sue that pervert. You have my blessing, but first let's talk Benny Choi. Yeah. He said he committed a crime. He's about to leave that poor girl purely unsatisfied. And also, it's just a lock. Just unlock it from the inside. You can either lift it up, like pinch that shit, or just... Just fucking unlock it. Did you attempt to use a buddy vipers back in Bro, time. if you broke into my house, interrupted my sex, and then called me a crybaby to my face, I'm not telling you jack nothing. Oh, there you go. Her phone's going off. Yes. Anemic sex from Sadouche. Yes. No, from Benny. They've had a thing so far where like the first people they go to have been the person. So, like, I don't know if it is the people they just went to. They had some other shit going on because it was just one of them there, right? Diego and Danny, I think, was the people's names. Diego and Denny, whatever the fuck. Or again, man, maybe Hector, his fucking bodyguard. I don't know. I really got nothing. I'm just along for the ride. But curiously, not human. <sighs> Are you not going to question the fact that he just dipped his fucking finger in blood and tasted it and said it wasn't human? You're going to roll with that. Not going to ask a single question. It's going to keep moving. I got nose hairs, by the way. Poor Diddy. Oh, no, not fucking Pig Diddy. This is the murder? They done killed Pig Diddy. Oh, I didn't know who else to call. I ain't no 911 for pets. Oh. Bacon for dinner, I guess. Bro, and too soon. Is Benny. Or Benny is doing this shit himself. Right? He's like plotting the stuff because Yellow Viper's out. Could be a threat, yada yada. They had some old beef, so he's just trying to like pin some shit back on him to get him back locked up and clear his name. That's a guess. That sounds like some shit that would happen. Oh, oh, so uh, yeah, yeah. a doctor, doctor to doctor thing. Yeah, basically, exactly. yeah. And hey, listen, if you have any patients you need to talk about, you have no idea. <laughs> Good, so it's settled then. You share with me. I, share I don't. With e you. I don't even think it would fluid be exchange. fluid exchange. We exchange of fluids. Maybe one drink. I think one drink sounds good. I don't know if necessarily she wants to talk about Lucifer, but she definitely wants to talk about. Oh, who was that dude's name that was in there? George or something? That Lucifer just busted on. Yeah, yeah. So it's seriously a community center. So this is where we'll find the <laughs> deadly yellow viper. Oh, you think I'm gonna let you bust my balls in front of these kids? Arrest me or step off. I like it, bro. My man's ten toes down. He's just trying to stand around with some motherfucking spray paint. Y'all better drop in fucking glizzies, bro. Everybody's strapped. And they got their, they got their finger up on the trigger, bro. Look, he's there just trying to protect them kids. Look, he'll take the bullets for him. Right. Put two and two together, bro. It's Benny. So you engage in turf wars, yet nobody actually owns any turf. Put your back, freak. All right, let's finish this. And those trousers, <laughs> and you wear the... He's so stupid. <laughs> you engage in turf wars, they don't like got no turf. Oh my god. What a fucking idiot. So low. Oh, I love that man. He caught that mother brother with a motherfucking running uh, clothesline there, baby boy. 
Oh. Oh. A punch right to the nose? What do you desire to do with the rest of your time on Earth? All I want to do is my art. That's it, bro. He's an artist. I swear I didn't shoot up any show. If I hated him so much, why would I bother to go after him and miss? That's a great fucking point. Yes, he's got a point, actually. I mean, to pop off in a crowd like that and not hit anyone, he'd have to be the worst shot in the world. Couldn't hit the... Only the best. Mm. Authenticity. Sure. Except for the lying. You failed to inform me that in getting you off the B&E charge, suspicion would immediately fall on your best friend. I had no control over that. Uh, didn't you? Oh. Planned a simple frame job, parole violation that would send Viper back to prison. But when Paola Cortez died, had to improvise, didn't you? Because you knew pointing the fingers at Latin Kings would eventually get back to me. How the hell could I have staged that frame job? How could I have pointed a gun at myself? Because you didn't pull the trigger. So many it was the ex-marine. No yeah, we game. all saw that. You probably Best won't. Marksman in the world. That's probably like some shit you say every time you meet somebody. Like, hey, what's up? I'm an ex-marine. Hey. Benny made me do it. There I'm it is. Fine, man. He told me he'd make me a partner. Winner. So pig, did he? Oh. I love that pig, man. Oh. Well, the no. good news is that what. Ah! Ah! Ooh, what a transition with his eyeballs, the taillights. I was going to say, you should, that art looks like something he would have. Even with the hole in it, you could stitch it back up. Be pretty solid. I feel like either she's been on another show for a second. When I first glanced at her, she reminded me of Kate from Teen Wolf, but it's not her. I'm still going to look it up. Consummate with a little <laughs> penetration. Look at her. She's always fucking with him. So I'll take that as a yes. You said you wanted danger. She loves fucking with him a lot. He gives off some heavy Sheldon Cooper vibes too. Mannerisms. Detective. Re replace detective with Penny. Same vibes. I don't even have a phone. Whose fucking fault is that? You're the devil. Go get oh. one. You just gonna play her like that? Faking in, going for the kiss, and then pulling away. I got these. <laughs> I'm back. You think the devil says bless you? Kazoon height. One of those things. Or is he just an asshole and just stares at you after you sneeze? That one was decent. That was pretty good. It Once it got around to it, it was like, okay, yeah, it's Benny. Usually the first people they go to has been the person, but I mean, technically they go to Benny first, and it was, it was Benny. He framed his own murder of his pig, blah, 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 trying to plant the stuff. We called that a mile away, no biggie. Lucifer treated uh, to an inside look at the ugly side of fashion. Armed with new information, a minute deal. Hatches a plan to get Lucy back home. So I made a deal. Is now working, which we didn't get any more of that. Now working side by side to uh, to Dr. Linda. Trying to, uh, you know, talk about patient to patient without leaking the patient confidentiality. Just talking, you know, doctor to doctor. Just getting some of their deets out and about. I respect it. Uh Chloe and Lucifer, I mean, they just, they're just getting closer and closer to just being besties. She says enemies. I say the next couple episodes, they'll become somewhat friends. Eventually probably fall in love, some shit. Whatever. I want to see where I know this person from. Ah, okay, so Olivia, the, their chief of whatever the fuck, she was in Bright, and she was in Den of Thieves. I feel like I know her from some other stuff as well. She has a lot of stuff on here. Yeah, yeah, I feel like she was also on some stuff. Probably some other NCIS stuff or whatever it was as well. Hmm. Okay. Do, 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 do. Where is it, bro? I know I've seen her in something else. There's True Blood. Hey, yo! She was Lydia in Heroes. Ah! There's the main one. Andy fucking Star. The Vampire Diaries. There it is. Andy Star. And she was on Entourage. Damn, she's been in a lot of stuff. And How I Met Your Mother. And Veronica Mars. And CSI. Bam. She was a stripper on CSI. Good for her. 
anyways, uh, you know, I made a comment to a friend, and uh, I was like, I really like this show. And uh, they said they hoped that I enjoyed it. So far, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I talk about it in passing. Even talked about it uh, to a couple peeps now. Everybody seems to really like this show. They say to wait till after the first season. My my whole thing is, is I, I'm, I'm worried that it's going to be just case after case. And I kind of wanted to have something kind of like how how um, I watched like the first season or two of Dexter. I hope it's how something like Dexter was where from when I watched it, where it was like showing cases, but it was mainly focused on him. I'm much more interested in Lucifer and Amenadiel and Maze than I am the investigations. But if our main focus is going to be on Chloe and his like him just being like enamored with her because he can't like get her deepest desires, blah, 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 whatever it is. And her slowly, I don't want to say taking sexual interest, but taking somewhat of an interest in him to figure out who the fuck he is, is a good like potential enemies to lovers storyline, which is clearly where it's going to end up going. A minute deal again, working with the therapist, to try to weasel his way in to get some information. Didn't know he could lie. That's pretty cool. Him and Maze trying to work together. Maze just wants Lucy back. She wants to be back in hell, doing her thing. Now she's out here stalking the detective. We'll see how that stuff plays out. I don't have too much to say in closing. That's really it. We Again, we have 13 episodes. Getting closer to kind of like that halfway point. Sweet kicks for the shoes. I don't know if they ever said it or not, but roll credits. They've been doing really good with the thing. I wasn't actually paying attention too much. Saying that he had a God complex really pissed him off. I wonder if we'll see God at some point in the show. Hmm. That's all I got. Season 1, Episode 5, entitled Sweet Kicks. Season 1, Episode 6, entitled Favorite Son. I'll see you there. Links and everything will be in the description box deep down below. Playlist will be up on screen. As always, stay cute, stay hydrated, and I will catch you on the next one.